Hi, this is Suze Lavantero. Okay, so I stopped the camera a minute so I can make some coffee. <laughs> I have it in my soup cup. Cheers. <laughs> stayed up a little late last night. I like to be in bed by 10, but lately it seems like I've been getting to bed later and later. <laughs> okay, so we're doing singles love readings. Okay, so um, the lover and the beloved here. I put this for visuals. Okay, and um, so now we're on, and here it says, enter the garden of delights. Okay, so I feel like the theme was, in the kind of the first three readings was like, let go of the past, right? That was one reading. And it, the other one was set your priorities. That's been a thing, right? And um, try different things. Okay. All right, so now we're on um, Leo. Let's get some love messages. These are messages that you could... Um, elaborate on or uh, these could be messages from you or your soulmate okay or person coming towards you okay all right okay so let's see Woo! we are the perfect blend okay that's cute a little heart one time a brista made one of those hearts uh, when I was in New Orleans so maybe um Louisiana is somewhere um, someone might be interested in you who um, has a connection with that or family there. Okay. Can't wait to be in your arms. Ooh. Okay. So maybe someone's planning. I get, I'm getting someone's already been planning about you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I love being with you. So they've already imagined it. Okay, so there's that. Okay, so, and this could be you too. All right, it could go vice versa, but that's what I'm picking up. Okay, so let's see. Let's get adventure cards. Oh, that came up for cancer, so let's put that up. Okay. Ooh, okay, so this one was lighting up right away. So let's get this. Okay. Oh, this one too. Okay. Okay, so it might be someone who doesn't wear shoes in the house. That I'm getting. Okay. Eyes open. Photograph all the tile floors you see while wandering. Ooh, okay. So this might be like, what, turkey or something like that? Okay. That's what I'm picking up. Turkey. Okay. Might be someone older than you. That came up in Cancer. So you might be uh, Cancer Leo cusping energy here. Okay. All right, now. Okay, so. Sit on the redwood stump and watch the trains pass by. Wow, this is really interesting because the other day, and this could be a message too, pay attention to what you focus on, right? Because what you focus on can manifest. Okay, the other day, I was taking a walk in the park and I found it fascinating how it was like a by tree, right? A by tree and the tree was um, like branching off and then someone had cut one side to make it where they could sit on it. Okay, so sit on the uh, redwood stump and watch the trains pass by. So for me, trains is spirit, right? So for me, this is get quiet and pay attention to spirit because the messages are coming. Okay, and, and pink is love for me and passion. And this is like the Tiffany color, right? And um, so that could be like wedding rings, okay. And turquoise could be like the spiritual person, okay. And a happy person, okay. Someone who likes chocolate. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's what I got. Okay, that could be you. <laughs> Chocolate and caramel. Okay, so uh, this could be your skin color, okay, or the person you're interested in. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Okay, all right, so maps instead of apps. Ooh, ask someone to draw you a map to their favorite place in town. Okay. So if you're doing this, right, you would have to be present in the moment and pay attention, right? Okay, I feel like that's part of the message. Okay, all right, now that came up in another reading. Okay, I think that was Gemini. Okay, anyway, all right, so football, I feel like going to sports events uh, is going to be a good connecting place, like the after parties. That's what I'm picking up. Okay. Now, if you are from the Middle East, you got to get outside. Um, okay, so what is that? Hold on. Okay, so okay, so people hang out in groups in their own sex. Okay, so if you're interested in the opposite sex, you got to get in mingle. That's what I'm getting. Okay, so. I don't know how you're going to do that. Okay, so, but you got to figure that out. Okay, that's your work. <laughs> Immersion, not diversion. If your trip is quiet, allow for one loud day. If your trip is hectic, plan one crowd-free day. Okay, something like that. Okay, so always coming home, returning to center, right? If, if things get... <laughs> I know how soccer games can get. <laughs> All right. So also fishing uh, hooks can mean good luck, right? Okay. So there's that. There's some kind of thing with good luck. Okay. Now, some of you, this is going to be a singer type, someone who likes to sing, and that's how you're going to recognize them. Okay. All right. Now here, slow it down, right? an itinerary for the day. Make a radical choice to slow down and cross off half your list. Let go to the, uh, let go of the compulsion to do it all, right? Okay, so sometimes that's important, right? Ooh, and I like that. That's like one segment of time, knowing that there's gonna be other segments. This isn't the same thing as procrastinating. This is for the, <clears throat> the one who overworks and needs to, uh, Move in ease. That's what I'm getting. Okay. All right. Let's get one more. What is this? Break habits. Pick a song for the day. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Pick a song for the day. Listen to it when you wake up. Hum it occasionally and experience this day through the tune. Did you see things differently? Okay, so now if I'm doing, if you were going to do this, I would suggest, um, like, um, music without words, or if it has words, choose songs that have happy words or about couples, right? Uh, that are in love, not choosing uh, something that's not happy, right? Choosing happy. Okay, so something like that. Okay, because sometimes people get in a habit of listening to the blues and sad songs, and that could be a tension focus, right? Focusing on that. And now there are different cultures that, that kind of have these kind of sad songs. Oh. Oh, that came that came up in a reading and that was another track that I didn't pick up so it's here okay so it's like that those songs that have that longing feeling right for the other person uh, there's no need for that take a break from that and um, that longing feeling is your lover is with you if you consider the non-physical right because the agreements are already there. So it's already with you. So it's about you waking up to it. So um, then choose a song without words or choose songs that have two people in love. Something like that, right? That are 
working it out. <laughs> okay. All right, the next one. The foliage, the color, the sounds, uh, the signage. Okay, so I, I'm getting someone who was born in the fall. Okay. IRL connection. Strike up a conversation with a taxi and rideshare drivers. They often know interesting history and unique spots. Okay, so it might be an air sign or a water sign, right? Okay, that's what I'm getting here. This could be um, earth sign or a Virgo. That, that's about the herbs and stuff. Okay, all right. So, okay, thank you. Ooh, this one wanted to pop up. Okay, what is that? Oh, here's an IRL connection. Ask a stranger if they'd like to share a table, play a game of cards, draw one another, or exchange something with you. Ooh, I like that because that would get you out of the fear of rejection, right? And if you do that with a stranger, right? Okay, so if you do that with a stranger and they say no, there's no investment there. I, I get that. Okay, so... There's no investment there, so it would be no big thing, right? You ask someone else, and then they'll say yes. Okay, something like that. Ooh, okay, so that gets rid of the fear of rejection. I like that. It's like connection. It's like moving from fear of rejection to the, uh, to the uh, loving connection. Okay, loving connection. Okay. Or playful connection. I like it. Okay, let's leave it there. Okay, thank you.